Hello everybody, this is Vertical Sandwich and welcome back to Let's Play Muppets Party Cruise. We're Kermit and we're rolling. And we're getting a three. And that stinks. There's gotta be a way to, there we go. That's the way to. Okay, actually, I think we can move just over here and try to win a red party favor. Welcome to Shuffle Chalk. Now go home. All we've gotta do is win Shuffle Chalk. Um, I'm gonna buy some. Cr you know what? No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not gonna buy any. Oh, especially with Gonzo buying 64 points. I gotta try to outbid that. It's not worth it. All right, time to redeem ourselves. Oh, jeez, Animal did great. See, now it makes sense to really just to bump this one off. Yeah, to make sure, you know, he can't capitalize it. Because if it sits gold. there for a second turn, then he, uh, then he continues to capitalize off it. Because it scores them every turn. So I think we're doing all right. Now. An animal apparently is hungry, which probably means he's not doing great. No stopping. No stop. Yeah, yeah, animal's not doing well, which is fantastic. Let's hear it for the amphibian, huh? Yeah, let's hear it. That's a good points we're putting up. I love it, cause winning is awesome, especially when you're Kermit. Kermit never wins anything. Jettison. Except again, the heart of Piggy, which ew, really people ew. Sorry, the Piggy Kermit thing has always bothered me. Like when they made the movies and suddenly they were like a couple and they were getting married. Uh -huh. I was, I thought that was ridiculous. I liked it better when she was in love with Kermit and he was just weirded out by it. I always thought that, that was funnier. Hey, hot frog, hot frog here. Okay, I think we won that. Huh. We completely won that. Even with Gonzo absolutely totally cheating. That wrong. And well, that's a game. I bet it'll be swamped with offers. Oh, ho, 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 ho. All right. Was that not our third one? Oh, that was not our third one. We must have won that one earlier. And so we replayed it and got I don't know what the prize was. I don't really it doesn't matter to me either. Well, good, because we just started a new video, and I would hate to end the game <laughs> three minutes into a new video. Although I do want to end the game at some point. Uh, especially since we're going to have to play other levels, and they're not going to change significantly. Uh, the characters, some of the dangers, the games are going to change significantly. Okay, so we're going for our second green party favor. Get ready to roll through my amazing maze. Gratuities are accepted. There's nothing more fun than... Picking up big hunks of sticky green cheese, especially in the sewer while balancing on beach balls as the world spins around you. Fun. Fun! That's all we got, folks. Let's do it. Gonzo keeps buying points. It's not going to help him because I remember I used to be very good at this game. I might still be very good at this game. It's not bad. It's actually, I mean, it's just you roll around and these pieces of cheese will appear. And uh, the issue, though, is... Uh, getting them later instead of earlier. And uh, eventually, a magnet will appear. Super. And you want the magnet because it attracts cheese. It's a cheese magnet. So. I was trying to think of what another a good example of a cheese magnet would be or what a clever thing to say about a cheese magnet would be. But the only thing I could think of was like Mystery Science Theater 3000 and its idea of cheese. So, we are monopolizing cheese magnets here, which is a good thing, because we don't want anybody else to have cheese, or cheese magnets. So, let's go get this cheese magnet. No, I want the cheese magnet, and then I want to head over here, where Fozzie can't get, apparently. I want that big piece of green no fair, cheese. No fair. Damn it. Damn you, Fozzie Bear. Damn you all to hell. Yeah, all right, get out of my way. I want another Super. cheese magnet. 
I think I'm clearly winning this, but I can't swear to that. If I could get over to areas like this a little faster, I'd be in better shape. I think that might have done it, though. That was a pretty good run there. Oh, yeah! Annihilated the competition! Because we're awesome! The frog wins! The frog wins! <laughs> Alright. So, now we have two red and two green party favors, no blue. But, we could very easily win the game at any moment now. All we need is one more red or one more green. Because again, anytime somebody gets three, the game stops. The next level, I think it'll be four, and then five. I think it gets up to seven, or maybe even nine. All right, Statler and Waldorf are gone. Oh, and it's our turn. All right. Fall into that nine. Awesome. Beautiful. That's Hollywood. Okay. Thought. We can go this way. And pretty easily get those. And then where can we go? Can we go anywhere in seven moves that would make any sense at all? Not really, but what we want to do, because it's, it's a little more important than uh, kind of anything else, is getting the longest move in the game. Not uh, more important than anything else, but it'll earn us a party favor. So we'll let Animal open some stupid door. I'm not worried about that. I think 12 should guarantee us the longest move. Superior. Oh, we moved 13. So, did he just say superior? That's a way outside of Animal's vocabulary. Money. Money. Ha -ha. Money. All right, blue. So we can't win the game on this one. Trust me, I'm a doctor. Okay, my shrinking box performs quite well. Luckily, you've been given small flamethrowers to battle the active atomic structures. Watch out for the sub-zero molecule. Big freeze. Show controls. Move and shoot. Okay. I got it. I have no idea how this works. I don't remember anymore. Oh, yeah! Okay. This is like a weird... Yeah, this is so strange. Your timing on this has to be just great. I mean, you really have to... Because there's a delay. You also kind of have to move backwards and forwards and stuff. But th isn't this essentially just like Space Invaders really fast with like Bunsen burners? And awesome music! It's playing Powerhouse! That's so great! Thank you, Raymond Scott, for inventing the song Power Out. Well, writing it, anyway. Well, him and his his orchestra. I don't know. I think somewhere, maybe it's not in my f favorites anymore, but at one point, one of, my, one of my favorites on YouTube was the Raymond Scott quintet playing powerhouse on Hit Parade or something. And it was fantastic. All right, I think we won that. Oh, yeah, we... Well, I don't know. If, if Fozzie bought a lot, we'd... Oh, he came close to taking it. So now, we're... We could only possibly win one more party favor without winning the game. Because clearly, we can only get one more blue one. Alright, Gonzo, get a two. Because I don't like you. You buy credits too much, or buy points too much. It just stinks of cheating to me. Oh, blue door. So now we could get... But I mean, the more party fevers we get, the more games we'll unlock. Bingo! Whee! Speed bingo is exactly what it sounds like. It's bingo as fast as possible. And, uh... You're scored not on just if you get a bingo, but on how accurately and quickly you mark your card. So it's very strange. But they put the numbers oh, in order. So you can just oh, check... 70. You know, where where it should be to see if you have it. And you won't have a big string of numbers, usually. So. The bunny yelling at you is kind of weird. You can usually tell when you probably have a number coming up. Not always, but it kind of makes sense. Like now, yeah, because like obviously I'd missed a couple, so. Oh, seventy-one. G fifty-eight. 
But I mean, this isn't really... If you've ever played bingo in your life, this is pretty... This is pretty simple stuff. And I don't know that I've ever not bingoed before everybody else in this game, because the computer will... is kind of programmed to make mistakes, I think. Although I might make mistakes because I'm talking. Who knows? Okay. No, come on. I figured that one was coming. Now we're getting to the point where we have a couple bingos we could get. Although that was not one of them. Two, Come on. 50, G, really? B, one, oh, 65, wow. B, 10, there it is. Oh, Yay! Someday we'll look back on this and laugh. B, yes! Six, oh. Whoa. G, 54, I, I had my finger on the analog stick 14, instead and uh, I, didn't realize that it actually worked out though. As the directional I, thing. 29, I, All right. 24, B15, G56. It's weird the way the voice of the announcer modulates too. B5, I, B7, All right. Come on. I want a bingo. B2, I, B10. Come on. B13. Next one's mine. There we go. Yeah, because it'll skip you a couple times and then give you one. It's pretty standard pattern. I mean, it's it's predictable. Now? No, now. There we go. Sometimes it'll give you two in a row. Oh. Forty-nine. Oh, sixty-one. G fifty-seven. Wow, we're we're doing good. We're getting close. Thirty. I twenty-one. B four. We need B one, I think. Nine. Nine. Oh, sixty-nine. No. Oh, seventy-four. No. And forty. No. Oh, seventy-five. No. Oh, sixty-two. Bingo. Bingo. We win. Without a doubt, we got both bingos. We got over a thousand points. We might have gotten the all-time high score in that game. Like, according to the AI. Oh, yeah. Easily. Easily. We blew the high score out of the water. 500, I think, is the score. Like, a perfect score in one game. Although, don't ask me how I got better than a double perfect score. But All right. Any party favors now, and we win the game. The game is over, and we get to go to... We get to unlock some stuff. Which will be fun. Oh, if we win this one, we've got it. Fozzie is teleported to Red Door. And it's an auction, and we cannot out... Oh, I don't think Animal could bid because he's cursed. So, we may just be able to... I think we could just buy this and win the game. So let's do it. Let's just do the best we can. As much money as we can. Or until Gonzo stops. Yeah, Animal can't bid because he's cursed, which is why he has so many party favors. Or cruise credits, or whatever they are. There we go. We won the game. We won the game with an auction. Yay! Which is perfect, because we have just enough time in this video to run through what getting the game, or what the game means. So. Kermit, you bought a red party favor. And there we go. Bonus party favor awards. Again, a lot like Mario Party, we get a Favor for finishing first. We get one for most games one. Uh, Animal gets one for most cruise credits. Two players tied for most games lost. Most doors open gets you one. And all three of them tied for the fewest party favors. And I get one for the longest move. So that's 10. That's a really good number. And then Animal could cash in for 500 a credit to get a party favor. In the later stages, that will be an issue. So we won. And uh, that's it now. 
This happens. This thing. It's just like everybody hanging out. They're like Kermit in the middle. They're like, congratulations, Kermit! Why does it say congratulations, sandwich? So there you go. There's your photo in your photo book. That's Hollywood talk. All right. So now we can spend party favors on new games. So like power boating and like select it and spend five favors to open it. And we've opened a mini game and earned a bonus video. So now we can find another five, five credit one. And check that out. Oh, we could do this one. We could do Fish Flinger, which is a great game. And spend three flavor, and we've earned a bonus video on that too. Um, and now we could just spend two to on Natural Disaster. And um, now, wait a minute. I want to go back. Oh, maybe I don't. Okay. Um, we want to do a long cruise with us and then I think um we will play as Fozzy and I am skipping Peppy I know that so now we can go to our video or one of them oh Bernie Bernie you have got to be kidding me I mean this is worse than the auto show gig yeah well, look there's no scent there's no wardrobe! I'm doing my own makeup! <laughs> Bernie, who are these clowns anyway? Yes, yes, I know it's Cable Bernie. Don't remind me, but a star of moi stature expects a certain level of professionalism. Wow, he hit some crazy stuff there. Kermit! Oh, Kermit, Kermit, I'm so sorry! Kissy, kissy! Who are you? I'm your wife! <laughs> there you go. Okay, so we get a bonus. We, we get... Uh, we, we, okay, we unlock new decks by unlocking minigames. So, um... We, uh... Did we just start another game? I think we might have. We did. We did. Alright, anyway, uh, we're not going to do that. We're going to get back to that game screen for the next video. But, here's the deal. So, every three minigames games we buy with party favors we've won unlocks a new level of the game. So, I will probably have to play some games uh, or play a game off camera to unlock some more games and get to the next level so we can play that. So, that's the way that's going to work. And then we'll show some bonus videos kind of interspersed. Uh, because they're all actual Muppets videos, and they're all fantastic. And I just realized during that video that I have the opportunity to edit my own voice into Muppet stuff, which actually makes me a little teary. But thank you for watching, and uh, I won't... I'm not going to draw this game out to a length uh, that is torturous. I just want to show it and have some fun with it and talk about the Muppets a little and play. So thank you for watching. I appreciate it. You guys take care, and bye, everybody.